This is E. Matthews Jet with the pre-unboxing of my 20-inch government profile rifle kit from Delton. This is to make a replica of the original M16. Uh, you can't get the M16 today because they're worth a lot of money. And Colt makes a copy of it, but they a lot of they cost a lot of money for me to buy. Uh, for what I'm gonna use it for, I just target shoot and shoot empty cans. Uh, my buddy's property, so I don't think it's worth the uh, sixteen, seventeen hundred dollars that they want in New Jersey to buy the rifle. So I'm making my own copy version, even though it's not a Colt. Uh, M16 style, 20 inch barrel, but I'm okay with it because I'm going to use it to shoot cans and paper targets. That's it. I have other ARs for home defense. For my go-to guns are different ARs I have. So this is not going to be a go-to gun. This is pretty much going to be uh, a plinker to target shoot. Okay, so this is it. This is a 20-inch uh, government profile rifle, uh, complete kit. It comes with the pistol grip and the trigger assembly, the buttstock, and let me move this under here then. Got to take this out. Under here is the M16 style buttstock. Let me put that back. Close it. So I'm going to build my own version of the M16, even though it's not, you know, a real M16. And I don't want you guys out there hating on me saying, but it's not a Colt. You're right. It's not a Colt, you know. But it's my version. And I'm going to use a... Uh, uh, Anderson lower that I purchased. Uh, we're in uh, January of 2023. And to make the rifle look like the M16, I'm going to add the upper. And the original M16 didn't have the rail. It had this piece actually molded as a one piece to it, the handle. I was looking for it to make it like the original. But I couldn't find it, so uh, it's okay with this one. Plus, it gives me the opportunity to play with some scopes. I'm going to put a scope on it and shoot out to a 1,000 yards and see how it shoots. I want to see the grouping. Well, in the, I'm in the state of New Jersey, so I got to do some changes to this rifle. I bought a compensator because you can't use a flash highlighter in the state of New Jersey, so I got to take this off. And in the state of New Jersey, you can't use the bayonet lug, so I'm cutting that off. It's sad because it looks so awesome on there, you know, as a bayonet lug. But in New Jersey, we can't have that. So, uh, I'm sorry, Delton, but I'm doing amputation job on you. So, I'm cutting that off and, and put a flash highlighter that I bought. It's in my gun safe. This is a... Uh, the spring with the buffer and here's my uh, trigger kit it's all Delton and it's gonna be on uh, Anderson lower and this came with my Bushmaster so this is a Bushmaster uh, M16 style uh, handle grip that's what you can call it so I have a XM15 E2S AR15 from Bushmaster, and this is what it came on it, but right now I got a different scope on it. Okay. And uh, over here, I got my Smith & Wesson MMP15 gener Generation 2. See that?
So my Christmas present from me to me is to build this. This is my gift to myself. Uh, I really don't need this because I have, you know, several ARs. You know, I don't consider myself an AR collector, but I own four of them. And I'm adding one more to the collection just to create that old M16 style uh, rifle that was used back in the 60s. You know, so uh, my goal is to have fun with it. You know, I'm going to shoot paper targets and cans with this shit. That's it. So I'm okay that this is not a cult law receiver. You know, and I'm okay that it's not Bushmaster, uh, Wyndham Weaponry, you know, that those are the rifles that qualify pretty much for this type of look. But I'm okay. This is a 1 in 9 twist. Uh, it's thick over here and it's thin in here. I checked it out. And what I like about this barrel is it's got the, the metal uh, interior that cools off. Like that, you don't burn your hands. It comes with a full automatic uh, bolt carrier. Very nice. I checked it out. Took it out. Uh, I received the box yesterday, and I opened it up last night. Uh, I was so tired when I came home from work, I just looked at it real quick, and I closed the box back up and threw it in the corner. Took a shower, watched a little bit of TV, had dinner, and I passed out. I felt like a rock last night. Well, today's Friday, and I'm looking forward to do some work tonight. I know by tonight, it's, it's going to take me like 10, 15, 20 minutes to do the lower and then throw the upper on it. So within a half an hour, the rifle's going to be completely built. Okay, so this is E. Matthews Jet. Showing you my new Christmas present from me to me. You know, everybody have a happy new year. I hope you had a great Christmas. You know, don't drink too much. If you're going to drink, don't get out of control. You know, there's people that over drink and they start behaving like assholes. I'm a social drinker. I'm a two, three beer guy. And that's it. I don't drink liquor. Uh, once in a while, I drink a little bit of brandy. And I'm drug free. Don't touch pot. I don't touch anything. Completely clean. That's the way I live my, my life. My life's supposed to be nice and boring. That's it. This is E. Matthews Jet. See you guys on the next one. On the next video. I'll show you the rifle build. I, I hate filming and building at the same time. Actually, I watch other guys doing it. And I just can't. I push the video all the way to the end to see the finished product. I don't want to see somebody going through the build process. And that's just me. That's my way of doing things. So I'm going to show you the rifle now. Take a look at it. And then you're going to see it with all the changes. Actually, you're probably going to see it built without the changes. But eventually, all, all this is going to be cut off and that replaced. It's sad to take this off because I like that. Bayonet log, even though I, I don't own a bayonet for it, I would never put a bayonet on it because I don't need it. And I I really like this uh, flash hider, uh, uh, flash highlighter, uh, flash suppressor is what they call it. Because it gives it that original look. Unfortunately, I got to take it off. Stayed on New Jersey. Okay. You know, for them, if it has a little thing like this, oh, it's an assault rifle, you can't 